In this video, I will show you how IEC 61850 Edition 2 Service Tracking can help you understand the exact cause of failed commands. First, I log on to the application. Then, I open the screen showing the single line diagram of the substation. I close two disconnectors. When I switch on the circuit breaker, you'll see its service tracking information. Service type, select with value. In the command processing screen, the operate action button is displayed. With command termination, I know the command was successfully executed. In the IEC 61850 server, I now make a change, which emulates a parameter change situation. Now I want to switch off the circuit breaker. In the command processing screen, you will see the information SBO select before operate rejected. This is a system interlocking and thus prevents the user from confirming the action. The service tracking information provides the information instance in use. Furthermore, it shows the detailed information parameter change in execution as a so called additional cause. Plus, you can find full information about the unsuccessful command and its cause in the event list. You see, with the IEC 61850 service tracking, it is possible to understand the exact cause of failed commands, giving you more transparency and higher operation safety.